Hello aspiring civil and structural design engineers. Welcome to the series of knowledge exclusively designed and launched for fresher civil engineers. If you are in your diploma, B.Tech or M.Tech and if you are a fresher or even if you are seeking for a job and looking forward for topics which are general and core technical to start career in the structural engineering line, then this particular series would definitely be very helpful for you to prepare for core technical job. This series is also run with live webinars conducted by Sandeep Pingle who is a passionate civil engineer and founder of eConstruct. So stay tuned to this channel for more details and check out the description box of this video. So let's get started with today's video. So today's topic is NDT and DT. What is the difference between non-destructive test and destructive test? How and why it is used in civil engineering projects? Destructive testing DT and non-destructive testing NDT are two common types of testing methods used in civil engineering projects. The main difference between the two methods is that destructive test involves the destruction of the test specimen while NDT does not. Destructive testing involves subjecting the test specimen to extreme loads or stresses to evaluate its strengths, durability and other properties. This type of testing often involves breaking or damaging the specimen, which means that it cannot be used again. Examples of destructive test methods in civil engineering includes compression test, tension test and flexure test on concrete steel and other materials. On the other hand, non-destructive testing involves testing the properties of the specimen without causing damage to it. This type of testing is preferred in situations where specimen cannot be destroyed or where the cost of the testing is high. Examples of NDT methods in civil engineering includes ultrasonic testing, radiographic testing and magnetic particle testing. In summary, the main difference between destructive test and non-destructive test in civil engineering projects is that destructive test involves destroying the specimen to test its properties, while NDT does not damage the specimen during testing. Both testing methods are essential in civil engineering projects to ensure the safety and durability of structures and materials. So I have given you a little bit idea about this particular topic which is NDT and DT which is non-destructive test and destructive test. To know more about it you can research more on this topic and also note as a civil engineering fresher you may come across these kind of terms in the interview as well and it's very important that you understand these methods in practicality. So stay tuned to our live technical webinar series as well to get more insights and more in depth knowledge about many such technical topics. I hope this video was helpful for all you aspiring civil and structural engineers. So I'll see you next in my upcoming video. Till then, thank you very much.